people welcome back to my channel i'm here to bring you all another bath and body works haul i'm super excited to bring this video to you all because i have been shopping the winter sas sale and i stumbled upon some really good gems and so i want to show you all what i picked up during my most recent haul so i'm gonna just hop right on into this video so the first item that I got is an item that came out during the fall and that I had been looking for for quite some time. Wasn't really sure that I was going to find it. I knew that it had gotten into the SAS uh, sale this year, but um, I was really late to shopping the sale. I really wanted to steer clear of it and um, I was debating if I was going to go, but I decided to go ahead and pick up a few items. And so I'm super happy I got my hands on this and it's in the form that I wanted it in and it is the pink velvet cupcake shower gel y'all so super excited to have this that's what the packaging looks like super cute this was the absolute last one there I'm really shocked that I found it but it is here and now I have it in my collection and I can review it for you all um the scent notes on it is sparkling red berries whipped pink marshmallow and sugared praline um, it has the little caption on here, if I'm going to read that for you. It says, sweetness, scents in the air, memories of lovingly made desserts swirl about, pink velvet cupcake, it's the season's most comforting confection. So, yeah, super excited to have this scent. I mean, it really just smells like, it's a sweet berry scent, which is really, really nice. Um... Definitely something I'm going to enjoy using in the shower gel form. I'm actually kind of glad they didn't have the lotions and the sprays because I think I would have bought them unnecessarily. I'm just happy that I have it in the shower gel. So yeah, pick this up during the sale. Um, next item I picked up here is the Iced Pear uh, Margarita Shower Gel. I don't know that I've tried this scent before, but I know that I'm a really big fan of Pear Berry. And so I think Bath & Body Work does really good with their pear scents. Yeah, and this one smells just as good. Um, but it has like a little twist to it. Um, so the scent notes on it is a uh, fiesta pear. So that's the twist that I smell. Fiesta, fiesta pear, Baja lemon, mango flower, um, Mayan sugar cane, and Mexican sandalwood. I mean, wow. Like, yeah, this smells like pear with a flair to it. That's how I would describe this scent. So I'll be really excited to use this during the summertime. And I think to go along, let me see. No, I didn't get it. And they did have the body lotion there as well. I was going to pick it up, but honestly, you all, I have so many lotions because I did shop the lotion like $2.95 sale. I didn't need to pick up anymore. So I'm just excited to have this in the shower gel. So I picked that up. Um, next item I found is the Fresh Sparkling Snow. I can't remember if I've used this up or not before. I believe I did, or maybe it was snowy morning or snowy day. Something with snow in it, but I actually really enjoyed it. It did remind me of a fresh winter Christmas day. Um, and so I decided to pick this one up. This is what the packaging looks like. Super awesome, like very modern and just, um, just I don't know, very sleek cutting edge type look to it. The scent notes on it is uh, Iced Pear, Frozen Melon, uh, winter apple, sun drop blossom, and frosted musk. So it has a lot of my favorite um, fruit smells that Bath & Body Work does well, which is the pear, the melon, and apple. I do have a review on winter candy apple. Frozen melon is, I like the cucumber melon, and then ice pear, I love pear berry. So three of my favorite scents in one, like, hmm, jackpot. And so let me get a whip here. Yeah, it just smells like a really nice blend of light fruits and outdoors like it just smells like winter time so yeah I really like this fresh sparkling snow so I have that in my collection now and then the shower gel I was most excited to find was uh I think it's a discontinued scent if I'm not mistaken I used up an entire fine fragrance mist of it it was actually my travel scent for quite some time and it is mad about you and I still have it in like the packaging that I'm used to seeing but yeah this is mad about you in the shower gel absolutely love this scent so much um so glad to have my hands on it again this is my first time using it in any other form of the body care besides the fine fragrance mist so I know that I'm going to love this the scent notes on it here is okay, so it has like a little paragraph so I'm just going to read that this passionate scent is a thrilling blend of black currant bright peony pink jasmine kissed with white patchouli and vanilla musk okay now yeah, y'all, if y'all are looking for a nice perfume, bright, floral, happy, just 
very just good scent <laughs> y'all need to pick this up this smells so good it smells like a nice um perfume honestly in a bottle so yeah really excited to have this so excited that i picked up two of these bad boys so i'm geeked to have this in my collection i'm just i'm gonna take my time and use it up and thoroughly enjoy it i wish they had had the body lotions though because i actually would have picked up the body lotion in this scent i do like it that much that i would have added to my collection for it but um they didn't so i wasn't able to pick it up um i have three more scents i'm gonna start with um, one of the lotions that I found. So this is actually Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. I know a lot of people really enjoy this scent. Um, to me, I wasn't the biggest fan of it initially, but during the sale, I was just like, let me go ahead and smell it and see what all the hype's about. Cause I'm not really a big pumpkin or pumpkin spice kind of person. I was like, let me smell it and see what the hype is about. It's actually a really nice scent. The pumpkin in it isn't too strong. And so... I think I'm gonna enjoy using this. I'm definitely gonna save it for next fall. And the scent notes on it is pumpkin latte, toasted marshmallow, creamy sandalwood, and praline musk. I think maybe the the marshmallow, sandalwood, and the, the praline kind of helps calm down that strong pumpkin scent that I'm not really a big fan of. And so, yeah, super excited to have this in my collection and to see how I actually enjoy using it. This is the 24 Moisture Body Lotion. And again, my little test for you all to know if the lotion is going to be good, moisturizing, and last a while is to hold it upside down. If the lotion does not move within the bottle when you hold it upside down, that's how you know you have a really nice um, body lotion that you're getting from Bath & Body Works. So I know that this is going to be super moisturizing and um, nourishing to my skin. And I also want to read like the little thing they have here. So this is from the Fall Traditions and it says, stir the fireplace embers one more time and wrap yourself in your coziest blanket. Now cup your hands around the frothy latte that says autumn is here. And so I love those little phrases they have on the back, but yeah, Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte, didn't think I'd ever have this in, come in my collection, but here it is. So this is a fall scent that I'll be using. And who knows, I might try to pull it out earlier than that. It just depends on how I'm feeling. I normally, I don't really stick to using my stuff during certain scents, during certain seasons. But um, yeah, we'll see if I end up pulling it out earlier than the fall. And then I was super excited to find my all-time, well, I, I think this is, yeah my all-time favorite fall scent um from bath and body works and the body care which is champagne apple and honey this product right here is so good this was the first type of body cream first scent in the body cream for bath and body works that i ever used and from there i was hooked the lasting power was good the um the moisturizing qualities of it was really good so yeah really excited to have this in my collection again and it looks like I got a nice fresh bottle too. No one's even like picked over it or anything like that. The scent notes in here is Lady Pink Lady Apple, Sparkling Champagne, Jasmine Honey, and Autumn Woods. Um, again from Fall Traditions, it says out in the orchid, out in the orchid, the one we always go back to. We breathe in crisp morning air and reach for the perfect red apple that reminds us that it is finally fall. So excited to have this in my collection again really looking forward to using this next year so i have this okay y'all now the items that i'm super excited about from this haul now these are the gems that i found during this sas sale these are actually from the aromatherapy line this is a um body lotion i'm sorry this is a body cream that i've actually never even heard of before i didn't even know they had this there but it is called joyful and it is from the aromatherapy line and packaging is really cute definitely reminds you of like Christmas time and so it's um, the body cream and it's black currant with pine and it says it has natural essential oils in it I'm gonna read the back here just to give you guys an idea so the black currant absolute is supposed to help energize the spirit and then the pine oil invigorates the mind um, it says aromatherapy tip massage into skin especially dry spots to lift your spirits with a sense of joy breathe deeply for best results and I must say this scent really is a very happy joyful scent like you definitely smell the pine in it I don't know that you necessarily smell the black currant I guess that is what's toning down the pine because I know pine can be a strong scent by itself so it just really smells like a toned down version of pine 
I guess the current gives it that 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 slight fruity hint to it. So yeah, pine with a slight hint of fruitiness to it is what this smells like, and I absolutely enjoy it. I actually used this once already, and I must say that I was very impressed with it. Um, it lasts a really long time, and it smells really, really good. It does make you feel happy, and honestly, this reminds me of the candle "Tis the Season." It kind of has that Christmassy vibe to it, um, but I guess "Tis the Season" doesn't really have too much pine to it, but. It just really smells like Christmas days, which who isn't happy on Christmas day? So Joyful is very, um, it's a very fitting name for this. So yeah, really excited that I picked this up. And the most exciting item that I found y'all is, da -da -da -da, I actually found the Eucalyptus Aromatherapy Essential Oil. It's a five in one essential oil mist y'all. I was thrilled that I found this. I have not actually, I've seen this in stores, but I've not actually used it before, and I'm super excited to have it. I sprayed it while I was in store, and it smelled beautiful. And so on here, it says, eucalyptus, known to be invigorating while encouraging, deep breathing, eucalyptus essential oil, clears the mind and promotes feelings of relaxation. And yes, it does. Um, it says it's an alcohol-free mist. It's infused with eucalyptus essential oils. It leaves you refreshed in five different ways. Number one, spray directly on skin. Number two, mist pillows and bedding. Number three, add to a hot or cold compress. Number four, spray in the shower. Okay. And then number five is spritz your yoga mat with it. So this item right here, super excited to have found this. I'm going to go ahead and mist it really quick and see... Oh, this is like brand new. <sighs> yeah, it's very, very invigorating. Very invigorating. This is something that really just kind of like calms you down. I really, yes, I really, really like this. So um, this is something I primarily bought. I don't know that I'll necessarily be spraying it on my skin, which... I don't know, after smelling it in the air, I think it would be good to just kind of help calm me down and relax me. But primarily, I bought it to spray on my linens. I normally use a fine fragrance mist to refresh my linens um, when I make my bed. And so this would be something really nice to just spray on my pillow and be inhaling and exhaling as I go to sleep. Um, I do also do yoga as well. So this would be nice to just kind of spray on the yoga mat to kind of release those aromatherapy vibes. And so I was so excited that I found this 75% off that I got a few of them. I actually picked up <laughs> three of these bad boys. So I was super excited to have this in my collection, y'all. Um, so that is actually it for my hauls. Um, that is all I'll be purchasing during this SAS sale. I'm sure that it's still going on right now. If it's not, I mean, depends on when I upload this video. Um, but yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the items that I picked up. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So if you like what you saw, feel free to stick around and join the big happy family over here. Um, let me know what your favorite item was that I picked up during the sale. I think definitely it was the items that I picked up from the aromatherapy line. I mean, it doesn't get any better than aromatherapy from Bath and Body Works. And so, um, it's super excited that I found those, but let me know what your favorite pick is from what I picked up during this haul. And as always, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.